The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Cruiserweight Championship. Making his way to the ring from Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland. Weighing in at 130 pounds, Peter Sokolov. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. see Pete Dunne make it to this level because this guy is going to be a star, a major star. An unmatched mean streak when it comes to WWE superstars. Pete Dunne knows so many ways to hurt you and he enjoys each and every one of them. Very rarely will you find a superstar who derives as much pleasure from hurting their opponent as Pete Dunne does. They talk about having it, Corey. This kid has it. Intangibles, the skill set, the entitlement. Pete Dunne believes everything belongs to him, and he'll take it forcibly if he has to. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance, and an insatiable appetite to be number one. And it looks to me like this entire arena is on its feet, and understandably so. If Pete Dunne is one thing, it's tenacious. Wow. The Bruiserweight's natural instinct is to always attack his opponent. The assaults that follow are devastating to a superstar's well-being. Forget about winning or losing the match. Man, Pete Dunne's finisher is appropriately named, Saxton. When a superstar gets dropped with the bitter end, they are not getting up. Whip! Boom! Oh, oh, oh. He's starting to stumble here. 
to be expected though. It's not like he's in there with a slouch, guys. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. This is all part of the process, guys. He knew he would take on some offense here tonight. He just has to make sure... Uh-oh! Is he done? I'd say every superstar remembers their first match on Raw, but for Pete Dunn, Byron, his first match has a little extra... He fights his way free. But how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? Final driver! Spiked him! We already established that Pete Dunne was successful in his first Raw match, but to me, the biggest takeaway from here is Pete Dunne into the quick cover. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Hey, I guess you never know. Irish whip. Wicked clothesline. Goes down hard. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Not yet. Too early. Boom! What impact! Uh-oh. Set it up! Nailed it! Ooh, what impact! He's in a little bit of trouble now. This very well may be too much for him to handle. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. Beautiful technique. Oh boy, he is rolling. Northern Lights. Uh, I think this is the beginning of the end. You've got to believe this one's over. That one definitely hurt Cole. His shoulders are down. And the fight must go on. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. I think we know what this is. Frog Splash! Give it five stars. This one... I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. Wow. Got the arm. Oh, my goodness. Crushing it. Oh, boy. He is rolling. Impact. He goes for the cover. One, two, and the shoulders up in time. Wow. He's in trouble. We've arrived. It's about time for the bitter end. Wow. What a gritty performance. He's going for the pin. One, two, three. This singles match has come to an end. Wow. These guys were awesome. Let's take another look. Check this out. This was another great moment. He's getting after it here. No doubt about it, he brought his A game as you can see here. your winner here in this singles match. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right. Don't adjust your TV, folks. This Vegas crowd really is this loud.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 252 pounds, Genie. There is an absolutely big fight feel in the arena tonight for this one. Yeah, and judging from the vibe here currently, it seems to me like this is the one this sold out crowd came to see. And his opponent, from Bombay, India, weighing in at 235 pounds, Sam Boone. Big time singles matches on deck here. And Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. You can expect these superstars to put their bodies on the line to take each other down. These superstars have waited a long time for this match to take place. And it looks to me like this entire arena is on its feet, oh. and understandably so. Up and... Face first, Slapjack. He's going for it all. What an incredible moonsault. Backbreaker. That'll realign your vertebrae. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. You never want to count a competitor out, but things don't seem to be going in his favor here tonight. Jeez. Shot block! This may very well be one of his toughest challenges in a very long time. Oh, man, his chances are dwindling quickly. He's just taking on so much punishment. You know, I thought this match was going to be much more tightly contested. I guess that's not the case, though. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, Nailed it. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. Oh, 
specifically targeting the leg. Looking for, you got to believe this one's over. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Moonsault. It, is that it? Is it over? That changes everything. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Here we go. Oh, man, what a leg drop. This one's over, guys. He's got him covered. Too close for comfort. With all the damage done, you have to wonder how much more it'll take. Sharp knee. Leg drop! I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Look at this! thinking to avoid that one. He's got the ropes and the pin is broken. But it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Oh boy, he is real. He wants no part of the outside. Going all the way up. We're seeing two out there. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Goes down hard. Oh, this is dangerous right here. He knows he's in trouble. He's looking at it. Oh, man, what a light drop. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. The shoulders are down. The pinfall and the victory. That match deserves another look. Here we go. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. Some pretty good give and take in this match as these highlights show. Look at him go. He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, Sam Boom. Without even breaking a sweat, this one is over. When you get a one-on-one -on -one match like that, you hate to see one of them come up short. But that's just the harsh reality of it. Guys, it sounds like we can all agree that was an extremely impressive win.
Guys, I was in the arena when the Elimination Chamber debuted in 2002, and somehow this structure has become even more destructive. The following contest is in a Elimination Chamber match. And it's for Corey, the Corey, what should we expect to see here tonight in this Elimination Chamber match? The, the only thing I'm willing to predict in a match like this is complete Ontario, unpredictability. Canada. You just Scott never know what's going to happen inside Blue. that demonic structure. You gotta wonder what's going through this superstar's mind inside that ominous structure. The very exclusive club of 22 Elimination Chamber winners and will have another member after this match. But the 100 plus competitors who will fall and pray to this structure will grow far Ray. larger tonight. Guys, one thing's for certain this Elimination Chamber will chew these superstars up and spit them out at first chance. It's as ruthless a match as there is, Michael. It's almost as if this structure has a pulse, and its sole mission is to cripple those who step inside. stars add tons of unforgiving steel and remove and all the rules. The challenger that is why Elimination Dallas, Chamber Texas. is so devastating. The Elimination Chamber match will undoubtedly be among the most vicious matches we've seen in a long time. Boy, that's the truth, Michael. There's no way to sugarcoat it. When you're surrounded by that much steel, you're in danger, period. I can't believe this match. I can't believe the superstars involved. This is going to be incredible. Dozens of the toughest men and women in WWE history have braved this structure and, and this combatant the joins their ranks tonight. From Providence, Rhode Island, Rage O Dashing. I can't imagine what it must be like locked inside the unforgiving structure. Time to get rid of all those nervous butterflies and focus on the task at hand. There's only going to be one winner tonight, but my hat is off to every competitor brave enough to even consider and entering the Elimination the Chamber. From Dallas, Texas, Alan Boone. Here we go, guys. Elimination Chamber match coming up. And in a match like this, it's not just about who's the most dominant superstar, but the luck of the draw is also so incredibly important. This superstar may still be the champion at the end of this, but they will never be the same. I can tell you that none of these competitors are happy to be in the chamber, but they all want to be here because the winner will be remembered forever.
and introducing the champion from Ann Arbor, Michigan. Guys, she the Elimination is Chamber is easily one of the most dangerous champion, matches in WWE. Louis Give these superstars a lot of credit. They understand Whoa. the dangers of this match more than we do, yet they still agree to step inside. Time to get rid of all those nervous butterflies and focus on the task at hand. The door to the chamber Ouch. is closed, and we are ready to go, guys. Introduced oh, by Eric Bischoff back in 2002, the Elimination Chamber combines pieces of Royal Rumble, Hell in a Cell, Survivor Series, and War Games matches. Oh, up and down! What a slam! <laughs> oh, man! Boy, the tongue just flies, doesn't it? She's in a bad way here, Byron. Don't count her out yet, Michael. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Challenger's taking on some offense. There's so much on the line for her here tonight. Right about now, she's realizing the trouble she's gotten herself into by agreeing to compete in the Elimination Chamber. I definitely didn't anticipate her struggling so much, but hey, crazier things have happened here in the WWE. James Ellsworth, 2016, is a perfect example of that. Boom! The Elimination Chamber is a type of environment where the battle never ends. Since there is no disqualification, a superstar needs to realize that someone who is eliminated can launch an attack before leaving the chamber, and it's all legal. That can have an effect on how much longer a superstar can survive the match. We're about to find out who enters next. Here's a cover. And the champ kicks out. It's going to take more than that. Byron, you spoke about something before that we've seen in a fair share of elimination chamber matches over the years. Some superstars want to, let's say, keep the fight going after they've been eliminated. Those individuals ignore the referee's direction and attack whoever they choose before leaving the chamber. If you're the victim of that attack, it could mean you're the next to be eliminated. Uh, we most recently saw that at the 2017 Elimination Chamber match. Baron Corbin was eliminated by Dean Ambrose. But when Corbin got back to his feet, he let the lunatic fringe know how he felt about it and made Ambrose pay. Then the Miz seized the opportunity and eliminated Ambrose from the match. Going to the cover. Since the Elimination Chamber's inception in 2002, there have been 20 Elimination Chamber matches. The Chambers decided the fate of the World Heavyweight Championship, the WWE Championship, the ECW Championship, the WWE Tag Team Titles, and the Intercontinental Crown. Here we go. took us through the incredible history of the Elimination Chamber. The first time the WWE Championship was decided inside the Chamber's cold steel walls was in 2006 at the New Year's Revolution event. John Cena entered the Chamber as the WWE Champion, and he exited the Chamber as the WWE Champion. The Elimination Chamber has become a major part of WWE history. Rivalries have been ended and created. This is it. The Whipper snapper. She's in firm control of this one. Look at her go. The Elimination Chamber is an environment that inspires human destruction. It breeds wreckage and carnage. Over the years, the pods that hold the shoulders on the mat. This battle's not over yet. Gonna think more than that. Back in from the floor.
more than 15 years, the Elimination Chamber has terrorized WWE superstars. Byron earlier, you referenced one of the times a superstar was sent crashing through the glass pod during an Elimination Chamber match. There are two occasions that stand out. They're considered two of the... The champion into the cover! She's looking to get out of here with a winner. And the match continues. This might be it! Oh, my! Alonzo feels unbeatable right now, but she might want to dial it back a little. Shoulders on the back. And the champ kicks out. Not yet. That'll mess up the back of your neck. Harsh impact. She sends her through the pod, and it just... Ooh, what impact. Victory is on the horizon. Shoulders down. She's not going away yet. Too soon. Oh, and it's a reversal. Kick with precision. She's looking at it. She's turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. Oh man, she's rolling now. Two. You're not gonna get her that easy. She's still in this one. Bringing it back into the ring. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. She is on fire. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Oh, and a snap man. I don't think you whip left. I think she's trying to prove a point here. When she gets in a tap mode, look out. Oh, the old head scissor. And that's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Oh, man, she's rolling. There's the elimination point. What took him so long? She's able to get out of the way there. Alondra Blaze. Alondra Blaze with a takedown. This could be it. She might have it. Whoa, her Karana. That's it. That's what she needed. Yeah, that truly was a thing of beauty. Beautiful technique. She's looking. the long line. Ouch. The champs, you know. Looks like she wants to win early. The champion has been eliminated. Enough already. When we talk about the Elimination Chamber and how its evolution has caused unspeakable pain to WWE superstars, we need to go back to the beginning. At the 2002 Survivor Series, this ominous struck... She might have it. The challenger in some big trouble here. This is not where she wants to be if she wants to walk out of this match with the gold. And this is all but over. Well, her chances certainly are looking bleak right now. And she escaped the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. Oh! Blackjack! Face first! Oh, this could be the victory right here! And kick out. This one's not over yet. Very nice. Real close. Too close for comfort. I can't believe she kicked out there. onto the WWE scene in the 1990s and held the Women's Championship on several occasions. One of Blaze's championship reigns lasted almost a year. Now that's dominance. We're looking at complete domination here. She's looking at it. And stopping away in the corner. Drop kick. Beautiful. Looks like Alundra Blaze is in huge trouble here. Alundra Blaze is just getting overwhelmed. Takes her down with authority. Man, she went down like a ton of bricks that time. The challenge is starting to slow down a bit here. Nothing she can't fire back from though. But there is no quit in this woman, folks. She will do absolutely everything in her power to ensure she's the last woman standing here tonight. Up until now, this match had all the makings of a good old-fashioned blowout. to avoid that one. And here we go from the German suplex. Release. He's back in full control now. Oh, oh, there's the elimination. Look out.
Arms up. Backslide for the victory. This could be it. Digging deep for a kick out. She just will not go away. Alundra Blade is doing her best to get in her opponent's head right there. Coming into the cover to the title of the line. New champion. New champion. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. Not yet. Too early. with a face buster. What have we got here? A side rushing leg sweep. Oh, 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 perfect form. The challenger not looking good right now. But can she turn things around and defeat the champion here tonight? Oh, man. She is being absolutely tortured in there. She might have it. I don't think this is going to do it. Oh, she gets out of it. But she's still struggling, Cole. The end might just be near for her. Oh! Oh, and she drops hard. They were looking pretty good for her now. Looks like trouble here, Byron. I don't know. I guess that all depends on who you're rooting for. A high-risk maneuver that works from that top turnbuckle. Look at her go. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. Beautiful. Wow, she's found her way all the way back here. Kick out at two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. She kicked out there, but I don't know how much more she can take. She is on fire. She's out of it, guys. Yeah, she's leaving herself wide open here. A few inches off there. Inches? She missed by at least a foot, Cole. Beautiful technique. Here she comes on the counter. We'll see if she can turn things around. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Oh, she gets out of the way. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. She looks for it once again. Oh, I bet you feel foolish riding her off. Look at this. Where's the elimination, Byron? That was amazing. Harsh impact. And that one does the job. It definitely dropped her, but I'm not so sure it's over yet. All the way up and around the world. Oh, the old head scissor. Keep your eye on this one. Incoming. Putting it all on the line. No surprise at how exciting this match is. Look at this. Can she keep her down? You gotta be kidding me. What a six man match. These ladies put on quite a show. Here's another gander. Critics of these ladies in the WWE might not have been very impressed, but they did do some nice things in there. Overall, this match was average at best, but not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. Nobody can say he didn't earn this win here. Really a solid, bordering on great performance. Here is your winner and new women's champion, Scott Allen Blue. Big win despite absorbing a huge amount of punishment there.
when you bring such a high level of intensity to the match, good things are bound to happen to you. Don't adjust your TV, folks. This Vegas crowd really is this loud. Byron, what can we expect to see from these two teams here tonight? Michael, I fully expect to see these two teams put on an absolute clinic in tag team competition. That's how good these teams are.
Byron, how big is this match for these two teams here tonight? Well, Michael, the tag team division is white hot right now. So while a win will obviously be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. about going anywhere. Here we go, guys. Tag team action is underway. These superstars are about to put on a clinic in tag team competition, guys. That's how good they are. Atomic drop! He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. He wants no part of the outside. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. This might be it! Oh, my! Up and knee drop! Jeez! Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to do that is to create that separation you spoke of so they have some space to gather themselves and time to make their way back to the corner. You're absolutely right, Michael. What's the use of having a tag team partner if you're not able to get to them when you got a tag out of the match? Getting that separation is key in breaking any momentum your opponents could have, making the difference between a win and a loss, maybe even more. So precise. Oh. 
Uh, tag made. Devastating kick. What's he doing? Big slam. He might have it. Challenger's starting to falter. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It looks to me like he's really trying to carry this team on his back, which really isn't necessary. still, but this could be a pivotal point in this match, guys. Let's see how he reacts here. Vicious strike. <laughs> Wicked clothesline! Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Dave the Woods, Big E, and Coach. Well, here it is. The old yeah. Man yeah. Much. Get it. There it is. One of the most amazing combinations you will ever see. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination. Looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage. And that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots. But I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record setting 483 days. A bad place to be for the challenger. His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. This is not the time to be a hero. To keep Ooh, what impact. Nice. Shut it down. Oh boy, he is rolling. Whoa, down he goes. He's on a rampage now. Look out, he's almost there. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has suddenly shifted here, Michael. No reverses it. Look out, look out. This could be it. What a sidewalk slam. Uh, he is finished. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. Champ's in a good spot here. Your whole body hurts after a move like that. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line. Good champion. It's going to take more than that to keep him down. That's all right, Cole. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Fame. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. Gets the shoulder up. Just needs to do more damage. Vicious knee. Controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown tag team champions. Looking at it, that'll oh, hinder your modeling career. Victory is on the horizon. tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. There was a lot on the line in the tag team tournament finals. The Usos wanted to add another tag team title reign to their resume and enjoy the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown tag team champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was a team no one expected to be in the finals. Slater had extra motive. We know it. Boom. Nasty impact. But he's got to capitalize now. You've got to believe this one's over. 
Don't be surprised if we crown a new champ here. He's in trouble. He's got him where he wants it. Oh. Powerbomb planted. This one is over. Keeping the match alive. Ah, backdrop suplex. Ooh, that might have just broken something. Oh, perfect kick. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. team in the back isn't watching this match right now, they're doing themselves a major disservice. Bringing it back into the ring. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. All right, his feet are on the ropes. His feet are on the ropes. I expected as much from him tonight. What an incredible tag team contest. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. I remember this part very well. Who could forget this? Oh, I can't believe this. And here's a last look at this one. A leverage pin here. Hey, it's only cheating if you get caught. Oh, this isn't right. What are you, the police you or something? The and buzz. still the tag team, Adam Bob and Sharp Rude Air Boom. What a great match and a huge victory to boot. These two work so well together, Michael. I'd be surprised if they went their separate ways anytime soon. Guys, somehow the Elimination Chamber manages to get even more exciting with each passing year.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. Guys, we have two of WWE's England. most exciting Weighing superstars ready to square off here. Pounds. And there's nothing quite like John seeing two superstars Ray settling it in Jer. the ring and one on one action, Michael. The Big Red Machine is here. And his opponent, accompanied by Paul Bear. And from parts unknown, weighing in at 300. 26 pounds, Kane! What a terrifying sight to behold. What a frightening presence. The evil inside this man. Matched by the frightening amount of destruction that Kane is capable of. A multi-time champion. He's dominated WWE for many, many years. These competitors are squaring off, looking to outmatch each other. It's going to be a tall task for one of these two. And I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match stole the show here tonight. What a stop. Good grief. Nailed it. Here he goes. Is he done? Oh, and he slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. I guess not. Spy Buster! Kane in a precarious situation. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially rebounds. Man. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. He's got the shoulders down. down. And Kane easily avoids the pinfall. Not even close. Suplex. Nice. Ooh. Take it off. 
off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. He goes for the cover. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. This attack. But if you're counting him out now, you haven't been paying attention. He has more resolve than just about anybody on the roster. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. No one ever thought anyone other than The Undertaker would have the power to perform the tombstone. What's frightening is, Kane's version is just as powerful. He's starting to stagger a bit. He's really going to need to create oh, some space for himself. I wouldn't call it a his favorite sidewalk slam. He's in control now. He's playing with him now. Here it comes. Straight to hell. But we've got a cover. For Kane, the power of the tombstone will end the match, but it only begins there. Kane wants to use the tombstone to end a superstar's career and send them straight to the fiery pits of hell. Kane's incredible power is on full display in the form of the tombstone power driver. We've seen the demon destroy giants with the maneuver. Superstars like The Undertaker and the 400 plus pound Mastodon, Vader. Take another look at these guys in action. He's getting it done here. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Remember this?
every single minute of this one was memorable. Here is your winner, John Race Durr. I can't imagine the pain that must have been inflicted by that move. That was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.